Ahmed Rashid with a celebrating name Anata, a celebrated Islamic wedding master of ceremony in Wa, was accused of defiling about 30 children in the Upper West Regional Capital. Wangana TV and a muhe mu bibia akwa ba Selko Northern Region wa ene niaka nimpate muwa nipa o trendi wo hopa eye abranti ya yefreno anata wo ye MC wo ye MC a chese ene charges a ye de bono e chese wo defiling kwala ma kuma ko tati anase ma nkwala nketwa ma kuma ko tati a ene asem no e wo court na omko court no enkoda ni bi Aba abe testify anase aba aba abe kan achre kot eh, kwa ya wadi wamo efa aswa chese ebikura achra sala time no we invite in kwa da makma ako 17 ena wadi wamo eko ni fie na okoye wamo di obeye wamo ene yegusu edi na asem na e eh, ngwangwa enye eh, ngwangwa se ni paba ako ya this accusation we ebe to so se and kwada makuma ko tati e ma makuma ko tati utimi di file o mo sa na se mi si ye odwane ye na so so gana police service e du du mo a o ma kwa ko chi nyen ko nyen ko ji nchire mu kakra ne ko so e wo court on he is a flight risk i will be i will be seriously surprised we are going to go through this trial and we will do it expeditiously according to a uk licensed clinical psychologist dr dona rockwell fame is a dangerous drug it pushes you up and shrinks you down could ahmed anates alleged defilement case be described as fame to shame well upper west pr tv has no answer to this question Ahmed Rashid, with a celebrating name, Anata, a celebrated Islamic wedding master of ceremony in Wa, was accused of defiling about 30 children in the Upper West Regional Capital. Following the allegations by the girls, Mr. Ilyasu Baba Yusuf, the chief executive officer of Bahas Foundation in Wa, lodged a formal complaint with the Domestic Violence and Victim Support Unit of the Ghana Police Service on behalf of the alleged victims. Upper West PR TV understands that Rashid Anata was first arrested in 2014 for allegedly defiling some children but was left off the hook but the last time he was arrested i was here i was still very young here as a, a, a lawyer but i remember it vividly that people went behind the scene and took the victims away so we couldn't get anybody to testify this time we have all that covered we have all our plans in place to ensure that nobody will go behind anywhere and touch any of the victims we are going to go through this trial and we will do it expeditiously. The principal state attorney told the media that the suspect was denied bail considering the gravity of the crime he was suspected to have committed, adding that he is a flight risk. He is a flight risk. Somebody who has left the jurisdiction before, we cannot be sure he will not escape. Considering the gravity of the offenses and the punishment that is likely to be meted out if he is convicted, we, have, we are talking about a minimum of 8 years and a maximum of 25 years for each of the counts. If we succeed in our case, he might be going in for a long time. So if the court allow him on bail, we might be left holding the cheeky end of the stick. We might not get him to try. On Monday, August 14, 2023, the suspect who is on trial at the Wasecute Court pled not guilty to all 15 counts of defilement presented against him by state prosecutors. Ahmed Rashid, 35, also denied five further accusations of attempted defilement when he appeared before the trial judge Jonathan Avogo. Madam Charity Baturo, Regional Director, Department of Gender, said her department have already given psychological counsel to the children uh, currently we've been able to have these children undergo uh, psychological counseling we've had a clinical psychologist take them through some counseling you know it's not just about us getting the prosecution processes being carried out, but we also look at the needs of these children so uh, we are still following through with them and we're also even ensuring that those that need to change school we change those that we need to um, do sensitization among their, their their communities is done we've also met some of their parents so for us we have a very very great interest in the case and we'll continue to do our best mr shaku also charged the media 
media to be circumspect in their reportage. And the media must be praised for the aggression you are showing this morning. We encourage you to keep, you see, it's oftentimes you just come for one day, show some little aggression and go to sleep. That also has its effect. This time around, I hope the media will sustain the pressure on this matter so that we will see it, it through in no time. Some residents also shared their expectations with Apoes PR TV. <laughs> Four out of nine witnesses have testified against Ananta. A medical doctor with other witnesses are also expected to appear in court on Monday to testify. My name is Idris Sudasana for Poes Pierre TV. Wa. Yeah, first of all, tap tap send. See, tap tap send. I'm a send it. I am so easy. I'm gonna for this year. Eh, what Netherlands? So what Netherlands? They are saying, "Hey, good news, man." You answer. So what Netherlands? Now send this car. Eh, they are ako Ghana. Ako two bank accounts. You man, I say, "Mubwa mani wallet swa." I just simple through ideal payment. Tap tap funds. Who you see? Eno. Eh, be buama si ka send now. Send now. So simple and reliable. Eno dan change swa. Ye fees and I rate a demon or was through ye pa. Yen Samson to away. Said only mono tap tap send so available our USA, Canada, UK, Ireland, Germany, Italy, France, Belgium, Spain, Portugal, and Afe, Dubai. Said that Tiana over download app no our app store and our play store. Na ye bisa se promo code no one gana shaho. E basa ye amount of five pounds and a five euros and a ten dollars. Depends on baby our there's a tap tap send it here. Pa pano no indeed.